What did you want to talk to me about? I realize this is kind of a big ask, but I want to defend my WWE Championship against John Cena. Beating him would solidify my title reign and put me up there with some of the top champions of all time. So, any chance you can make that happen? You know, maybe give him one of those mandates to show up and face me? Yeah, I wish it was that easy. I mean, don't you think I've already tried to get Cena to appear on Raw before? He would bring instant star power along with a guaranteed ratings boost. But the reality is he's busy with various TV and film projects and isn't interested in a return right now. So it's pretty much a lost cause. If I were you, I'd focus on something else. I wouldn't be where I am today if I just quit anytime I was up against some adversity. I'm going to get John Cena to come back to WWE and face me. And how are you going to do that? I'm going to take a little trip down memory lane and revisit some of Cena's career highlights. Maybe that will get his attention. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 228 pounds. The WWE Champion, Mad Dog Mac You. Here's an individual who knew competition as auditioning for roles in movies and TV shows. No one expected this. He had to overhaul his entire way of life to survive the training at the Performance Center. But give credit where it's due. He's here now. Well, I'd say this is anything but awesome. He's spoken like a true jealous Z-lister, Saxton. You're not even allowed on this side of the velvet rope. And his opponent from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds. The This is a superstar who truly makes everyone around him even better. Think about his gorgeous wife, Maurice, his two daughters, hell, even me. Uh, uh, what about me? What about you, Saxton? Miz doesn't want anything to do with you. The Red Brand's rolling out the red carpet tonight as the current WWE Champion has invited none other than The Miz to Monday Night Raw to square off one-on-one. -on -one. It's a heck of a gambit, Michael, using The Miz to provoke one of WWE's greatest champions of all time, John Cena. And it's a gambit that could easily blow up in the WWE Champion's face. Plus the edge 
dislocated hands and feet. Like he's got 11 arms and feet. He's lost some of his win now. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Beautiful strike combination. Ooh, DDT to follow. The Miz at the complete mercy of his opponent. Not an A-list performance here from Miz. Yeah. Step over. DDT. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Oh, enough already. Oh, the Miz has been busted open. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Here we go. Shooting star press. Just mounted with punches and not. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Efficient offense leaving no breathing room. He is just dominant right now. Oh, Miz turns the tables. Opportunity now for Miz to capture the momentum. Also, a good chance for Miz about it. And gentlemen, the Miz may be fading away here. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Yeah. Oh, back fist to the mush. Step over. DDT. You doing here, Corey? Uh-oh, look at me locking in. Submission locked in. After all that punishment, he had no choice but to tap out. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner, Mad Dog Mac. You! This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. So this whole Cena thing, hate to say I told you so, but you know what? I don't hate it at all. I told you so. I know how it looks from your perspective, but I promise it's gonna work. I just need more time. And besides, I never said this would be easy. Fine, but if you don't get at least some kind of acknowledgement soon from Cena, then I'm pulling the plug. What's your next move? Spotlighting a major loss didn't seem to work, so I'm going to go in the other direction. Oh yeah, I actually got wind of your idea for this already. Trying to replicate Cena's first WWE Championship win by beating JBL? Don't think it's going to matter, but I'll make it happen. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 228 pounds. The WWE Champion, Mad Dog Mac. You! He wasn't an athlete. 
athlete per se, but after he endured the rigors of trying to break into mainstream Hollywood, he developed an athleticism perfect for competing in WWE. And now he's proven he's not someone to be underestimated. former broadcast colleague, guys. A wrestling god. And his opponent from Dallas, Texas, weighing in at 290 pounds, JBL. Now here's JBL, a triple crown champion. He's held the WWE title, Intercontinental title, and U.S. title. He's a member of the WWE Hall of Fame and a bona fide wrestling god. Hey, guys, have I ever told you that JBL is a really good friend of mine? That's a lie, Byron. One of the best brawlers in WWE history. Hey, Corey, you think JBL will pay the medical facility bills for his opposition tonight? Fresh off a big win against The Miz, the WWE Champion will try to get John Cena's attention one more time tonight against one of Cena's former WrestleMania foes, JBL. JBL's a Hall of Famer that can still go in the ring and has a Hall of Fame voice to boot. Give that butt kiss and a rest, Saxton. I'm just stating facts, Corey. of strikes. Like he's got 11 arms and feet. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. God. Enough already. Brutal knee right to the face. Really just laying it in. First up. Both wrists captured it. Looks like he has the upper hand now. Yeah, he's firing on all cylinders. Oh, look at this. German suplex. And not done yet. Another German. And continuing to punish their opponent with a German. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. He reverses it. Could be just what JBL needed to battle back in this one. Super kick! What a counter! Mat slam with some attitude. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Watch out! He catches JBL with a counter. Kicks to the lower back, clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here. Relentlessly. Arms trap. Endless knee strikes. 
JBL could be moments away from being beaten. JBL gets drawn in. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. Fresh off a big win against The Miz, the WWE Champion will try to get John Cena's attention one more time tonight against one of Cena's former WrestleMania foes, JBL. JBL's a Hall of Famer that can still go in the ring and has a Hall of Fame voice to boot. Give that butt kiss and a rest, Saxton. I'm just stating facts, Corey. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Hit the ropes. Oh, running knee strike. Vicious combination of strikes. Looks like he's got 11 arms and feet. Bradshaw struggling to defend himself. JBL has to gather the energy to turn the tables. Just striking at will. Backed off with a DDT. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Gosh. Enough already. He's struggling a bit here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Oh, fish is deep in the face. Kicks to the lower back. Clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here relentlessly. What you doing here, Corey? Putting the pressure on now. An extreme amount of. After all that punishment, he had no choice but to tap out. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner.
Oh, there was a potential opening with Cena, and you blew it. I don't think it's over. Are you crazy? He turned you down and then you insulted him? We can forget about a match. He probably won't even come back for a simple appearance now. So thanks for that. I'm telling you, I think I struck a nerve with him. And a man like that is too proud to just let that go. Let me do one more thing to get his attention, and if this doesn't work, then I'll move on. You've already tried one more thing two or three times. He's gonna respect the fact that I won't give up. And then you'll get your star power and your ratings boost that you want so bad. Ugh, what do you want to do? I want The Undertaker. What? Let me explain. Cena was in the exact same position I'm in with The Undertaker a few years ago at WrestleMania. He was so desperate for a match he bought a ticket and sat in the audience waiting. When Undertaker eventually did appear, Cena lost in five minutes. I remember all that. What's your point? I want to send Cena a final message by doing what he couldn't do at WrestleMania. I want to defeat The Undertaker. That's really pushing it, but I think I can make it happen. And if Cena sticks to his word and never answers your challenge, then at least I'll get the ratings boost I was looking for with The Undertaker. And if Cena does change his mind, then even better. All right. Looks like you got yourself a match against the Phenom. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 228 pounds, the WWE Champion, Mad Dog Mac You. Don't forget that while this competitor was trying to carve out a career in Hollywood, he was also a member of the WWE Universe, watching Raw, SmackDown, and NXT every week. That familiarity with WWE has certainly given him an advantage transitioning from entertainment to sports entertainment. Oh boy, look who's here. The Phenom has arrived and demise awaits anyone who stands across the ring from the dead man. The Reaper walks among us. And his opponent from Death Valley, weighing in at 299 pounds, the Undertaker! of the Phenom. Truly a mesmerizing scene. The legendary Phenom creates an atmosphere unlike anything you will see. Talk to anyone who's ever been in the ring opposite The Undertaker and they will tell you nothing prepares you for this, the stoic walk of the dead man.
You know, Undertaker is a time-honored warrior of the ring. No matter what you do, I'm not sure there's anything that prepares you for The Undertaker. So many superstars have stood across the ring from the dead man, paralyzed with fear. The WWE Champion has been on a roll, but tonight the champ will have to take his game to an entirely new level as he takes on the incomparable WWE legend, The Undertaker. It's the WWE Champion versus the Dead Man on Raw. This is huge! I have a feeling that even John Cena is going to be taking a break from his busy Hollywood schedule to watch this one. That's certainly the Champion's plan. Let's see if it works. Undertaker's really being tested here. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Setting it up. Boom! Both wrists captured. And that was nasty. Beautiful strike combination. Ooh, DDT to follow. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. God. Enough already. Tag. Punch. He is efficient and dangerous with his offense thus far. He's got that determined look. Taking flight. Shooting star press. He is just reeling from that offense. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Uh oh, not a good place to be. Oh, three. There it was, the Undertaker now wearing a crimson mask. Knew what was coming from Taker. Play. Nicely done. German suplex, and not done yet. Another German, and continuing to punish their opponent with a German. He's got the Undertaker dead to rights, and it looks like the gunslinger's out of ammo. Up into the torture rack. Oh, the life drain from the dead man. Makes the cover. victory tonight for the WWE Champion over the Phenom himself, The Undertaker. You never want to overlook an accomplishment like that, but I think the Champion still has other things on his mind. John Cena, over the past few weeks, I've done everything I can to prove to you that I'm worthy of a match that I'm worthy of your time. I mean, I just beat The Undertaker, which is something you couldn't do. So you know what? Maybe, maybe I've been looking at this the wrong way. Maybe it's not about proving that I'm worthy of your time. Maybe you're not worth mine. I have to agree with the WWE Champion here. It's time to move on from this whole John Cena thing. Wait a second. It's John Cena. The face of WWE has come home. 
I can't believe it. After weeks of unanswered challenges and then Cena himself saying it wasn't going to happen, the WWE Champion has gotten John Cena to return to Monday Night Raw. And there you have it. Cena is back for one thing, the WWE Championship. Hey, this is a matchup that no one thought we'd ever see. And now it looks like it's happening. This is going to be one for the ages. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. Big match here, guys, as the title will be on the line tonight. And the champ has looked dominant of late, but all it takes is one wrong move, and that title could be going home with somebody else. Since 2003, I don't know if any other superstar has defined WWE in the same way as John Cena. Yeah, a man has been defined by his passion, a man who's been defined by his work ethic, and a man who has been defined by Hall of Fame success here in WWE. here tonight. Byron, you should strive to be more like John Cena. I do. John Cena is a man who's always practiced what he preached. He embodies never give up and hustle, loyalty, respect. Introducing the challenger from West Newberry, Massachusetts, he never weighing in at 251 pounds. From where I'm sitting, he is the greatest WWE superstar in history. 
Cena is a superstar in every sense of the word. In fact, and introducing the champion as Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 228 pounds, anybody is the WWE champion, Mad Dog Mac. That's what it's all about, the WWE Championship. The challenger wanted this opportunity, now he's got it. Well, it's always fun to go to the zoo until you fall into the lion's den. The challenger had better sharpen his teeth. Wakes a grueling battles of all, led the WWE Champion to this moment. A chance to etch his name into the WWE history books against the one and only John Cena. Talk about box office. Two of the biggest draws in sports entertainment are fighting for the right to call themselves the true face of WWE. You want to talk faces? The WWE Champion finally got his wish. A chance to carve his mug right up there on a WWE Mount Rushmore. Plus the educated hands and feet. Buffalo strikes. Both wrists captured. And Cena's starting to falter here. Cena needs to find some energy fast. DDT. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Oh, enough already. Sent into the corner. Oh, strong knee connects. The challenger not looking good right now. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Punch! And he's just flaunting his skills now. This could be his moment. Soaring. Shooting star press. Both wrists captured. And that was nasty. Oh, a bunch of strikes. What a combination. And a DDT to follow it up. Oh, right to the back. Setting it up. Oh, boom. Oh, look at this. German suplex. And not done yet. Another German. And continuing to punish their opponent with a German. Cena's looking absolutely powerless. A defenseless Cena here. WWE Champion, Mad Dog Mac. You! This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. The following contest 
is a last man standing match and is for the WWE Championship. Here we go, guys. The championship is on the line here in this one. And I'll tell you, Cole, the champion has never looked more dominant than right here, right now. An absolute legend in my estimation. The greatest WWE superstar of all time. Time to do it one time again. Let's go to work. Listen to this place. I believe the most polarizing superstar in WWE history. The greatest of all time, John Cena, set for action here tonight. Arguably the biggest star in Introducing the challenger from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Star weighing in at 251 pounds. by Mr. McMahon is the Babe Ruth of WWE. There is nothing John Cena has not accomplished in sports entertainment. And introducing Wait, the champion like from Boston, you, Massachusetts, John Cena weighing in at 228 pounds, JBL, is the WWE champion, Matt Dog, Matt Dog. It is the richest prize our industry has to offer. This is the WWE Championship. Welcome to what should be one of the most brutal championship matches we've ever seen between the defending WWE Champion and one of the most decorated superstars in WWE history, John Cena, as they face off in a last man standing match. That means that one of these two extraordinary athletes will need to keep the other down for a full 10 count to walk out of here tonight with the title. It's hard enough keeping Cena down for a three count, let alone 10. Let's see if the WWE Champion has what it takes to pull it off. Coming in hot. Up to the top rope now. Watch out. Good Lord, taking flight. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Uh, right to the midsection, step over. DDT! Cena now taking the brunt of the attack. Cena's perseverance being tested. Enough already. He caught that with his face. But now John Cena is leaking. Oh, there's an arm breaker. Right to the spine. What are we about to see? Oh, knee right to the hips. Who won the race? Charlie's horse. Uh, 
Delivered into the barricade. And a big boot. A bad place to be for the challenger. And we're deep into this last man standing match now. Every blow makes it harder and harder to stay off the ground. And he is now in a discouraging spot. Yeah, he's got to surmount this storm coming at him. Boom! The stomp in every single part of his body. Oh, there's an arm breaker right to the spine. Brutal stomp to the body and just getting started. Look at this brutality. This is how you torture your opponent. Oh, my God, this is hard to watch. The party's over. Well, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. But champions need to finish the job. Two. Three. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. Cena is unable to stop this string of offense. Cena has to find a way to reassert himself. Beautiful strike combination. Ooh. And a DDT to follow it up. And stopping the count for some reason. What's that all about? He's not ready for it to be over yet, Cole. We got a long way to go. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. Arms trapped, burying knees into the body. Looking to pile on more offense rather than let the count go out. Oof. And now he's dictating the pace. Yeah, it's one attack after the other with him. Double axe handle. And just like that, stopping the referee's count, continuing this match. Obviously has plans to add more insult to injury here. Buffet strikes. Throwing salt in the wound now. Oh, colliding with a barricade. And a big boot. Guess he didn't think that was enough. Striking while his opponent... And it's not going to be pretty. Ooh. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Two. Good news. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Up to seven now. This could be it. Champ adds to their legacy. Yes, he here is your winner. Both and in time. still, the WWE Champion, Mad Dog Mac. You. No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt kicking. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one sided as it gets.
This superstar looks determined tonight. Whoa, oh. from behind. They're going to settle this right now. Backstage is where you can lay waste to your opponent in a hurry. They must have lost their minds. Everyone in the back needs to stay away from the oncoming devastation. Oh, look at this combination of strikes. Oh, Looks like he's got 11 arms and feet. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Just striking at will and DDT to follow. Oh! Oh! Otis was ready for that. Oh! Escaped just in time. Reverso catches Otis there. Bang! Able to give him the slip. He's got him scouted. Step over into a DDT. to avoid any harm there. Oh! Oh, man! Boom! Oof! Oh! 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 And Otis was ready there. Oh. Super kick! He was waiting for him to make his move. Oh! Oh, my! Way to steer clear. Oh, it's a recipe for cracked ribs. Oh, with authority! He knew that was coming. Oh, ouch! Face first into the chair. Otis in some big trouble. Oh, man! Well, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Well, it's not going to be pretty. No. Oh. I had the Viking Raiders on the podcast, and we did a segment about the current Raw roster. Who's the biggest prankster, the messiest, that sort of thing. Guess who they gave the ugliest scowl and least likely to get a date award? <laughs> I've got your trophy back at the office if you want it. I've been looking forward to this one.
The following contest is a handicap match. Introducing first, from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 228 pounds, Mad Dog Mac U. Here's an individual who knew competition as auditioning for roles in movies and TV shows. No one expected this. He had to overhaul his entire way of life to survive the training at the Performance Center. But give credit where it's due. He's here now. And his opponents at a combined weight of 552 pounds. Ivar and Eric the Viking Raiders. You are looking at a team that delivers a tag clinic every time they compete. But tonight might be their best lesson yet. Thinking you've got a chance to beat not one, but multiple WWE superstars speaks to a little bit of ego, doesn't it? A uh, little bit? No, it speaks of a lot of ego, as big as this arena. But if you can somehow pull off an upset, what a notch in your belt. Hey, Mike, you show me a WWE superstar with no ego, I'll give you a dollar. That's a good point. Educated hands and feet capped off with a DDT. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Arm trapped. Just endless knee strikes. Kicks to the lower back. Clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here relentlessly. Looking for a high risk move. Incoming. Shooting star press. Everything working against Ivar now. Yeah, Ivar needs to get moving as soon as possible. Set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, sharp knee. Look at this. Oh, kicks. Oh, man. Good grief. Turn your lights out. Ooh. Step over. Into a DDT. Just stopping every single part of his body. 
And he's really gotten into his zone right now. His offense is second to none at times like this. Oh, stiff punch. Kicks to the lower back. Clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here. Relentlessly. Yeah. Double axe handle. And Ivar looks clueless as to where he is right now. Ivar's vulnerable here. This was a truly spectacular win. This win is spreading like a wildfire. The electricity in this arena is almost palpable.